at 9, a reported case of road rage coming to an end after a driver smashes a woman's window. Police are still looking for the driver that attacked her car. 7's Katrina Bush has the details of this problem at the pump. Some man just broke my window. He's in a black Mercedes Benz. A frantic call to police reporting a case of road rage in Fort Lauderdale. Oh! The victims following a man who was driving mad in a black Mercedes. That is how the ordeal ended, but here is where it began. At this intersection in the 800 block of South Federal Highway, around 645 Friday evening. There was a car in back of us, a black Mercedes Benz, honking, honking very aggressively. A slow left turn sparking anger. The Mercedes driver following the Mazda to the pumps at the Shell station. Kiana Shine says the man got out, threw a can at her, and then started coming straight for them. I rolled up my window as fast as I could. Before I knew it, he hawked and spit on my window. When they thought the coast was clear, they decided to go ahead and fill up with gas, but accidentally hit the button for the trunk instead of the gas compartment. Before they could do anything about it, they say the guy was back, and they decided to get out of there. As I'm trying to pull off, you just hear boom. I look back and the whole glass is shattered. They say the man grabbed a microwave that was in her trunk and threw it onto the car. He slammed it here, I guess, and it rolled down. That's when he finally took off. They followed trying to get his license plate number, but he would easily outrun them. And I'm taking this for evidence. Shine filed a police report. She's hoping he's caught and held responsible for what she says was an unprovoked attack. Nothing. We didn't do anything to him. And he's a like clean cut guy. You would never expect this. Never in a million years. Katrina Bush today in Florida. And if you have any information that could help identify that driver, you're urged to call the Fort Lauderdale Police Department.